Hey guys, welcome to uh, this radio video. Here's a little demonstration of a mode that we don't hear very often called Olivia. Heard this on 40 meters this morning. And here's the decoding of the Olivia signal on my screen right here. So this is Olivia 8500. It's decoding quite well actually here as you see. And even though there's a lot of noise on the signal, still decodes quite well. Look at how difficult it is to see the signal in the waterfall. And still strong decoding. Really nice. So how do I know that this was an Olivia signal? First of all, I have uh, went to a page, a web page, that has audio clips of all digital modes from amateur radio. And uh, I was pretty sure by the start of the signal that this was a, probably an Olivia. What is complicated probably is to get the right mode because when you go here into off mode and go into Olivia, look at all the modes that there's possible and so depending on what type of signal that you're listening to you have to choose the right Olivia type here and so um, what I do is I click on one I check if the red little red bars here are wide enough for the signal the first modes it was just too narrow so you know that it's not the right mode because it doesn't fill up the signal on the waterfall and when I stumbled about 8 500 then I saw that the red bars are pretty close to what the signal looks like. So you know you're not far when that happens. So it's pretty cool. This is a very, very clean signal as you see here. From stations, uh, two stations having a chat on this mod, KC2VUT and K3CC. So it's pretty nice and very clean signal. And even with the uh, key up, as you hear, someone's keying up there, still doesn't change the decoding quality, which is pretty cool. So it's a very, very solid mode, as you see here. It's always fun to decode new modes. The, I've heard one Olivia signal last week, but it was too short and didn't have time to make a video. But when I started, uh, This morning, I um, started to uh, listen to it. Now, I'm starting to notice that Olivia signals are often on uh, 073, so uh, 7073 or 14073 seems to be the spot where there's some Olivia activity. Each mode tries to have its own frequency range, you know, like uh, RTTYs from uh, 080 to, uh, to uh, dot 100. Um, there's BPSK is often on 070, uh, JT65 on 076 and the ending frequency. So once you get the hang from uh, what frequency usually they use, pretty cool.
pretty cool. But this was K3CC. Notice how it seems to uh, be a little behind, you know, it's decoding and the stations are ended and it took a little time before it sent to uh, K3CC. Seems that I don't hear KC2VUT, so uh, so that's nice little decoding of an uh, Olivia signal. Olivia being a digital mode. And here it goes. Oh, signal just started here. It's very weak. The other station is extremely weak, but look at that. Even with an extremely weak signal that you barely hear, uh, it's still decodes and this is KC2VUT so uh, continuing the conversation pretty nice so I hope you enjoyed this little demonstration of Olivia and uh, this is decoding with FLDG um, software hope uh, you guys uh, want to decode some digital stuff this is the reason I'm making these videos show you how cool it is to decode digital signals on a computer from shortwave 73 oh, here we go